Bokitov Khabarim, I'm Stephen Benoon. You're watching Israeli News Live. We have breaking news this morning. The ring of fire has really begun to light up once again. It kind of reminds me of what Tom had to say just the other day, how that, uh, that, that they were expecting an increased volume of earthquakes uh, going on and how that they would just only get stronger and stronger. Let me kind of zoom in on this for you guys so you can kind of get a a better look yourself. Uh, hopefully you can. Um, this morning a, a powerful 6.7 earthquake did strike Ecuador at about uh, 4 a.m. this morning their time only a couple of hours ago but this all began it actually began down in Taiwan going on to the very opposite side of the Pacific Ocean in the Ring of Fire there we had a 4.7 earthquake that hit Taiwan, okay, right there near uh, Taitung, the city of Taitung, showing you there on the map there uh, what happened there. And then from there, of course, 4.7, the ground is getting to moving pretty good with a 4.7, but it's not, it's not a major movement as of yet. Okay, so then there again, like I said, that is on May the 18th. Then we... Uh, uh, which is this morning, all right? Then we had from there the Philippines begin to rock and rumble with a 4.6. Uh, all this, all these earthquakes happening pretty much simultaneously, one right after the other. However you want to say, I'm not uh, taking the very. Let's see. Let me try to get the timestamp there. That's uh, all right. Then we have okay. That is at 28.72. 28. Okay. Uh, I'm not sure what time frames they're using for these, uh, if it's, uh, okay, UTC time. All right, so yes, they're, they're happening pretty close together, one right after the other. The, the Philippines happened uh, just after midnight, okay, UTC time, and then the Philippines, again, about 30 minutes after midnight, about 12.28 p.m., all right, then we have the Alaskan earthquake struck at 325 this morning. Two of them, one right after another one there, uh, 4.6, then a 4.4 tremor followed right after that. Uh, then the Virgin Islands also hit, got hit by 3.0, and the Fiji Islands, a 4.5 earthquake as well by 546 this morning. Now, it wasn't over. That ring of fire, as it went around from the Philippines and, and rolled its way back around up into Alaska, then it came down and it began to start pounding on Oregon as well. Uh, and, and Oregon got hit with smaller ones, 2.6 and a 2.9 around Mount Hood, and then finally came right on down the coastline there, hit South America with a 6.7 in Ecuador, rattling their cage really well this morning. Again, 6.7, there's still uh, not much evidence coming out as of yet, just breaking news that there is the earthquake. Uh, it is early, early morning there. I'm sure as the daylight comes out and the news crews get out, we'll be able to get more footage on what's going on. I'm Stephen Benoon. You're watching Israeli News Live. Bokitov from Eastern Europe.